In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to configure the optional report a bug menu in your app settings. This feature allows your logged in members to submit reports about any bugs they might notice in your app. Before I demo the feature, let's go into the WordPress admin so I can show you how to configure it. Here I am in the WordPress admin at Buddy Boss App Settings Feedback, and then we scroll down here to Report a Bug. We can check this box to enable the Report a Bug menu in the app, which as you can see, I've already enabled for this app. And then for the bug report email, you would enter the email address you want the bug reports to be emailed to. And then here for email subject, you would enter the subject line you would like to be used in all of the bug report emails. By default, it will be structured as your website's name, and then this text report a bug. You can give it any subject that will make it easy for you to sort through these emails. And then once we're done, we can scroll down here and click on Save Changes. You will notice we have another feature here called Send Us Feedback, which adds a similar menu in the app for sending general feedback. It's up to you if you want to enable both of these menus. The idea is that users are reporting a different kind of feedback while reporting a bug versus just giving general feedback. And internally, you may want to forward these emails to different people or teams within your organization. Now let's go back to the app so I can submit a bug report, and then we'll go check on what the email looks like. Here I am in the report a bug screen. If viewing the screen on our public demo, you will also see an email field. We use this field to collect your email when you submit bug reports on our demo, but in your actual app, every logged in user has a real email associated with their account. So we are able to automatically include their email with the submission. This email is useful to you as the site owner if you want to follow up with them later about the issue they reported. All right, so I'm going to describe a bug. Something looks wrong. And I can also upload an image to attach to the report. Let's select the screenshot from within the app that I took earlier, and then we'll click send. and we can see that the bug report has been sent. Now let's go view the email. Here I am as the site owner looking at the bug report email that was just sent to me. And we can see the message, something looks wrong. And we can see that our photo was attached. And then we can also see some device details here to help understand the nature of the bug. So first we have the app ID. This is the ID of the app where the bug report was submitted. Platform of iOS. So that means the user who submitted this bug was using iOS. This is the app version they were using. And this is the version of iOS that was installed on their phone. The device model was an iPhone XS. And then here we have the email of the user who submitted the bug report. And that's it. We hope you find this feature useful as you launch your own BuddyBoss app and as you gather valuable feedback from your own users.